How to buy assets. Assets are investments that will earn money over time. Anything that you buy that rises in value can be considered an asset. That said, assets most commonly refer to financial investments in stocks, bonds, or commodities. Each asset has its own risks and potential. It is often a good idea to buy different types of assets to maximize your investment. Deciding what type of assets to buy. Purchase stocks for potentially high yields and easy liquidation. Stocks are easy to buy. They are also easy to liquidate, which means that you can convert them into cash easily compared to other assets. That said, stocks have much higher risk attached to them since their value can fluctuate based on the company and the stock market. Invest in bonds for a low risk and low yield investment. A bond is like loaning money to a company or government. The company will pay you interest on the debt. When the bond matures, you will get your principal or original investment back. This maturation date may be anywhere from 2 to 30 years. Bonds carry fewer risks than other types of investment, but you may not get as much of a return. There are a few risks to buying bonds, but they tend to be small. For example, if the company shuts down, you may not receive your principal back. Alternatively, a better interest rate might come once you have bought the bond. Invest in commodities for potentially large yields with high risk. Commodities are resources that you can physically buy and sell. They include gold, oil, cattle, and other major products. The prices of commodities are very volatile, but they can be very profitable. Commodity trading can be very complex. It is generally only recommended for people with established investment portfolios. Buy items and property that will gain in value over time. Art, stamps, antiques, and other products often rise in value over time. If you sell them, you may make some money. These are considered alternative assets. They are not very liquid, so it is harder to convert them to cash. If you know much about art, you may be able to purchase some valuable pieces from known artists. These will likely increase in value over time. Real estate is often considered to be an alternative asset. This requires a high principle to start. Rare stamps and coins are a highly specialized type of asset. It may take a long time to find a buyer. That said, these popular collectibles can fetch high prices. Consult a financial planner for personalized assistance. A financial planner can evaluate your current finances to help you create a portfolio of assets. They can help you plan and achieve long-term investing goals. A good financial planner is one who will sit and talk with you about your needs, goals, and questions. Look for a certified financial planner CFP. These consultants have passed a rigorous exam that proves they are an expert. You can find one at a bank or investment firm. Tell your financial planner if you have a specific goal that you want to save for, such as retirement or buying a house.